Oh my god! Hey guys, welcome back to my world where no matter how old you get, you never need to grow up. And I am so sad because it's my last fail fix unboxing. I am so in love with these dolls, guys. Like, you know, doll collectors, we were all a little bit like, mm -hmm. and then we were like, mm -hmm. yeah. And um, I think they're just a great, I mean, I, these definitely, if they're not on some hot lists this year, I would be really surprised. The only thing, parents, that I'm gonna warn you right now, I talk about this in every single video, I'm gonna try a new method here, is that they are ridiculously hard to get out of the packaging. So what I'm doing this time, guys, trying a different approach, I'm just gonna cut right around the plastic. I'm not even gonna try to wrestle with the cardboard. I'm just gonna cut through the plastic. And, and that's my approach this time. I've tried many different approaches. I have war wounds to prove that these are the hardest dolls on the planet to open. Um, there's just so much tape and glue and, and things involved in rubber bands and stuff. It's just, it's physically painful, actually. Um, these are under $20. I didn't even show you which doll I'm opening because I'm just like, oh yeah, you know this doll, right? Everybody knows, okay. So, Kawaii QT, um, she is probably the most popular one, although I still think you know who I love. Um, and because she's got the purple hair, because she's got the whole kawaii thing going, and the surprise fashion thing is, are we gonna get her day, her sparkle, or her evening outfit? I have yet to get an evening outfit, so it would be really cool if I got her evening outfit, but I'm okay with it. Um, she wants cutie buns to be a thing that happen. Thankfully, she comes with these little pom-poms that match her hair, because that's the only way that's gonna happen. <laughs> we will see how that goes. Um, while I'm filming this video, we've got the other one that I had started. She's over in the window with her hair drying, because that hair was just um, crazy. So, um, parents, you, you don't need water. Um, you can, if you watch my other videos, you'll see that you can just brush and keep brushing and keep brushing the hair. And that's what I like about it is that it's a, uh, it's, it's a doll that takes some time, um, to, to play with. Like, you don't just like, like open it and go, eh, and then just sort of, you know, throw it on a pile. So I like that really a lot about these. Okay, guys, cutting through the plastic, new way to get to these dolls. New, 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 new method new new melissa approved method um so yeah i mean there's there's a lot of it, they take time they take time they take some perseverance and then they come with like so we've got these little rubber bands here um and you can you can do different styles like you don't just have to do i want to make sure i'm not cutting an important elastic here no i'm not it's a barrette okay um you can do, you know, you can practice hairstyling and doing different styles. And then if they want, if they want, kids can, with your permission, of course, um, and supervision, um, you know, rinse the, the crusty, crusty gel out of the doll's hair. Um, but they don't have to, to enjoy the doll. So that's just want to make that clear. Um, with a lot of brushing, the, the the gel loosens up and and it's all it's all good. Okay, so now here's the part where they also come with a stand, which is really nice. And for a doll at this price point, it's kind of surprising. So this is what she looks like. And then we're gonna take off her robe and find out which outfit she's getting. <sighs> is it possible that I got an evening outfit just once? Just once, I don't know. Although I do like the unicorn uh, dress that she's wearing in so in her day and sparkle version. So I won't be tragically disappointed if I get the other one. So just just so you know. All right. Oh God, I think maybe I just no, I didn't. Okay, I was like, oh my God, I think I just cut the dress. Nope, I didn't. So kids will probably need your assistance depending on their age to get these dolls out of their packaging. So just be aware of that. Um, if you're buying it as a gift, it is, the struggle is real <laughs> when it comes to getting them out of the box. 
Um, this is definitely like a, you know, they're, they're gonna make great Christmas gifts, but lay off the eggnog until you get these out of the box so you can lose a finger. Ta-da! We got her regular day outfit, but I'm totally okay with that. Did we? Wait, wait. <gasps> oh my God. We got her evening outfit. I did not realize that it was so different. My eyesight is so bad anyway that I, oh my gosh. Oh my God, I got an evening outfit. Got an evening outfit, woo! Yep, way too happy about that. Way happier than a 52 year old woman should be about this, but judge me not, or judge me, I don't care. Um, I really don't care. <laughs> I, um, so this year for senior year of high school, uh, for my son, we homeschool and we, we unschool. And so what I'm doing is I am, uh, he's reading books all year assigned by me and they're all uh, self-help books that as I read them, I thought, man, I really wish somebody had told me this, you know, 40 years ago or whatever, 30 years ago. So our first book that we're reading is The Life-Changing Art of Not Giving a Bleep. And uh, it's pretty funny. It's pretty funny because it's a good reminder for me too to just not give a, give a bleep about too many things. <sighs> the struggle is real. Just trying to get her out of the packaging. Just trying not to lose a finger. Ha! Ah! Yeah, so parents, yeah, just don't hit up the eggnog until after you've done this, okay? Because you will lose a digit. All right, ugh, oh! ugh. Oh! Whew, that's gonna be an Olympic sport someday. <laughs> Getting a fail fixed doll out of their packaging. Okay, she's so cute. Oh, look at how cute she is. With her little pink shoes up in her hair and all of her little kawaii accessories all up in there. And her face is just like, just the expression is so like, mm, so not what I was going for. Oh. Just so, no. Like even just like, look at the eyes. This, I just love this. This whole thing that's going on over here with this, with this look on her face. That's what I love about these dolls and the masks. And you can put the face masks back on, by the way. So now we are going to reveal her face. We're gonna put the bubble, the bubble mask on. Bubble mask, big meaty hands. By the way, I did my nails. Like I, 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 I caved and I, I, I put my static nails on because they're pop-ons. They're really good pop-ons. Because um, I have so many cool dolls to open and I just couldn't bear to look at my stumps. Okay, so are we ready to see? See her makeup, what she looks like with her evening outfit? I almost like feel gypped because I really want <laughs> Actually, I want every version of every one of these dolls, so that's a problem. Here we go, meaty hand. Big meaty hand. Ooh. Oh, wow. Oh, that's cool. Oh, I love it. I love it. Collectors, come on, you know you need her. Look at that. Look at that makeup. And I say it like almost every time, like I love how they made it look like they have rooted eyelashes by just creating a plastic ridge here at the eyeliner line. And it just gives their eyes that much more dimension. Oh my gosh. Oh yeah. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, she's pretty in her eye color. Oh, okay. Let me get her shoes out of her hair. I almost want to leave her like this because it's so cute. I have to get another one where I leave her in her little distressed state. Get her other shoe out. Let's get your shoes on. Her shoes are so cute. Oh, she's so kawaii. Love it. Oh my gosh, look at her shoes. Look at her shoes. One of them has a pink bow on it. So cute. Okay, and then she's got 
Like her jewelry is in her hair, of course. Um, her earrings are stuck up in her hair. And then she's got a lot of little, uh, oops, almost lost an earring there. Um, she's got little clips and, and um, barrettes and stuff for her styling of her hair. Mm. Oh, wow. Oh, gosh. Oh, my gosh. She's adorable. I'm really happy. How about you? What are you thinking? I mean, I still, I st I still love, I still love my Toya. That's what we named her. Um, but uh, this one's really cool. And it's funny because I thought I wouldn't like her as much because everybody likes her. Does anybody ever get like that? Like, I just obstinately don't want to like the thing that everybody likes. Not sure what that's about. <laughs> like, I got to be a rebel. Oh, everybody likes that one? Well, I like this one. I don't know. Don't know what that is. That's just the thing. So what you do is, if you haven't watched one of these yet, is the hair is super gelled. I mean, super gelled. So parents, this takes time, okay? And this is, once you get it to this point, pour the eggnog, <laughs> pour yourself a glass of wine, whatever it is you're gonna do, and then just let your kid go ham on brushing out this hair, okay? Because it takes time. It takes time. But it's fun and it's relaxing and it's therapeutic and, um, you know, don't give in to the temptation to do it for them. Um, I know a lot of times I see, um, instead of kids, instead of parents playing with their kids, they play for their kids. So like if a child's having, like, let's say a kid is like getting tired or just like not really loving the experience of having to brush out all of this gelled hair, they might bring the doll over to um, an adult and say, I can't do this, do it for me. And then you find yourself sitting there, like in front of the TV, uh, drinking wine, watching Real Housewives and brushing out a doll's hair and the kid is nowhere to be seen. Don't fall into that trap. You know, like they start the Lego set, you finish it for them. There's no reason you can't sit down and do it with them. There's, there's no reason you guys can't sit down together and kind of work on the hair thing. Say, okay, well you hold the hair out and I will brush through it. Or here, I'm gonna wrap it around my finger and you brush over it. Don't do it for them. Um, my mother's calling me. One second. Okay. My mommy was just checking in on the birthday boy. So as I was saying, you know, do this with your kids. Don't don't just do it for them. Don't play for them. Play with them. And uh, especially now, now more than ever, we really need to be doing that. Um, you know, I spend a lot of time uh, listening to Caden talk about video games. A lot of time. Video games, animes. Um, He'll sometimes come downstairs and be like, oh my gosh, you have to watch this funny video. He just introduced me to Clone High. I don't know if any of you watch Clone High. Um, and, uh, you know, so he, he shares those things with me. And I listen and I'm present and I pay attention. And I put down my phone and I turn off the TV and I'm there. I'm like, he's the only thing. Like, I'm not, you know... I'm not working, I'm not editing, I'm not, um, you know, checking Facebook. I'm there with him because I realized uh, from doing it the wrong way for a long time that, um, that first of all, it's rude. And second of all, you know, these precious moments with our kids go by really fast because believe me, it feels like, like just, it feels like I just found out that I was pregnant and he's 17 now. Like it goes by so fast. So even though you're, you're trying to find ways right now to juggle a lot of things and, and your nerves are frayed and you're like, I can't, I can't do it. I can't do it. Enjoy this time with your kids. Enjoy this extra time with them at home. You know, it's, it's kind of a special gift we've been given. Um, so yeah. All right, yeah, see hers brushed out way nicer um, and less crazy than the other one. I'm just gonna snip some of these extra long pieces here. Okay, there we go. See how pretty that is? Just, and you just keep brushing it and you get all the gel out. 
And it's very pretty. She got very pretty hair. Yes. It's like a lavender pinkish color. I really like it. And it's very kawaii. Thank you. Like, I would leave her like this. No, no, but I want my, I, want, I, need, my, I need, need my little, my little balls at the top of my head. Don't even. <laughs> She's so cute, I can't stand it. Okay, let me get your jewelry on. All right. Um, here we go. Doll earrings. Although these are easier than, it's starting to get hot out. It was so beautiful this morning. It was like 68 degrees and it was breezy and I was driving to McDonald's and Walgreens. I had the windows rolled down. I was blasting Def Leppard. It was so beautiful. <laughs> Any Def Leppard fans out there? Any Leps? Anybody like the boys? All right. Oh, geez. I have so much trouble with doll earrings, man. Eh. Eh. Okay. Working on it. Okay, there we go. Oh, yeah. And then this is her necklace. Like, I mean, the jewelry and stuff isn't like super high quality, okay? It's plastic, it's not super colorful. Deal with it. <laughs> it's all about the hair and the makeup on these dolls. All right, so now you want your pom-pom thing look. Yes, that's what I want, okay. I'm gonna try, I'm gonna try. Let me try, she says. Okay, so this is the look. So, what we want is, it looks like, is it just a ponytail? I mean, I could do a ponytail. This is what I'm supposed to end up with. I could do this. I can totally do this. It's a half pony. I can, I can do this. I can do this. I have the skills. So I'm gonna start by pulling back the front section of her hair. Very meaty handy, like that. Okay, wait, wait, let me get some of, the, let me get some of this here. <laughs> it's so good that my kid turned out to be a boy because I don't know how I would have taught him teenage girl hair. I, it just would not have happened. I mean, my mom didn't teach me, so. <laughs> my mom is clueless with hair too, so, okay. So we got this, we're doing this, and then I'm gonna take one of the, here we go, here we go, pink rubber band. Look at my hands, this is like so professional. Hashtag so professional, here we go. I'm gonna try to get it somewhat in the middle, okay. So we're gonna do this. You're kind of pulling at my head. Yeah, I know. I'm dangling by my hair here, deal with it. Do you want your pom-poms or not? Okay, all right. So we got that, all right, we got that look going for us here. Now it's wavier, it's not straight like it looks in the picture, too bad. And now I have two pom-pom, I have two fuzzy pom-pom barrettes. <clears throat> Let us attempt to install two fuzzy pom-pom barrettes. Okay, I can do this. This is nothing, oh boy. <laughs> No, really, I can do this. I have one fuzzy pom-pom barrette. Now let's see if I can get the other one. This was always the problem with pigtails. Like you do one and then you're trying to get the other one to be on the same level. And my poor kid was always walking around like, <laughs> <laughs> messed up pigtails. Ugh. Okay, here we go. I think, I think I'm doing it. I think I'm doing it, oh my goodness. Ugh. Oh my goodness. I think I'm actually getting the hang of this. Look, I think I did it. No, I didn't do it. <laughs> no, you did not do it. All right, wait, let me try again. What is wrong? Oh, one is, too, one is down too low. Which one should I change? I need to move, I need to move this one up higher. That's what I need to do. Okay, it's two, two on the side. <sighs> you're pathetic. You know, you're not very nice. I'm kawaii cutie, doesn't mean I'm nice. No, I, I think it does. <laughs> Kawaii means cute, not nice. Oops, oops, we lost a ball. Oh, you're pathetic. Stop that! She's not being nice to me, guys. It's my internal monologue. <laughs> my own internal monologue is being mean to me. 
Okay, there we go. I have achieved pom-poms. Uh, okay, whatever. We'll let Caden fix it later. Okay, and now in your picture, you have some of your uh, hair accessories in front of your pom-poms. Oh dear God. <laughs> <laughs> come on how bad could I mess this up don't ask come on they're just little barrettes I mean really I can't mess it up that badly this is you we're talking about Melissa have a little faith oh god <laughs> oh my gosh I'm having so much fun and this is only the second video man I'm, I'm like gonna have the best day okay look I did it I did it! I achieved her look! Come on. This is one of the best ones I've done. Admit it. Admit it! I'm admitting nothing. <laughs> I'm just gonna put the blue bread over here just to annoy her. <laughs> yeah. Mm-hmm. I'm crazy. I am a crazy person and I like it that way. I do like it that way. By the way, I will put a link down below to the book that we're reading right now so that you can enjoy the life-changing art of not giving up. Bleep! Warning, <laughs> warning, it's got bad words in it because <laughs> it's a grown-up book mm. about not giving up. Bleep! About what people think about you, what people say about you. Mm. Mm. about getting doll stands together <laughs> well, okay well it's not about that but you know it could be it could be mm. there we go all right so kawaii cutie i did it guys all right comment down below how much do you love my 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 my, my expertise here in the world of of doing kawaii cutie's hair come on you know you love it. Um, I will put a link down below to where you can uh, buy her online and it may be an affiliate link. And if it is and you use it, that means I make a little bit of money. Thank you. And I'm so sad because this was my last fail fix doll to open. I don't have any more to open. If I could like know for sure that I was gonna get the di different outfits, like I would buy more. Did anybody figure out codes yet? If you figured out codes, please let me know in the comments down below because I really love them so much. I really do. I really, really do. So thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys again real soon. Guys, we've got a very busy LOL remix week ahead of us. <laughs> so excited. So make sure you're subscribed and all that kind of good stuff. I'll see you soon. Love you. Bye.